The United States, the U.S., we the people, the divine us. This all started with one major focus in mind, the hope of freedom. The hope of religious freedom, the hope of political freedom, the hope of financial freedom. The hope of freedom for a better life for our children and for our children's children. Because the hope of freedom is all about us, it matters how we share our story. For truth matters, but so does tone. Living into our hope as followers of Jesus, the worship of whom we have chosen to undertake, gentleness and respect is our goal. For everyone we meet has the same hope of freedom. Everyone we meet is a part of the divine us. Our goal is not condemnation, vindictiveness, vengeance, insults, harshness, nor dismissiveness. Our goal is to tell the story of our blessed hope in the grace of God. The very same grace that gives each one of us the possibility of freedom. There is a healthy dose of humility that goes along with this hope of freedom. For we realize that none of us deserve freedom, but all of us hope for freedom. This realization binds us together and opens our hearts and minds to a better way. You have the freedom to ignore or dismiss anyone's story. Yet you cannot ignore or dismiss your very own story. Yes, you are free to keep quiet. Yet in so doing, you rob our shared experience of the hope of freedom. The United States, the U.S., we the people, the divine us. Our faith in Jesus, as well as the foundational focus of our great country, isn't about a philosophical idea, a tree that falls in the woods when nobody is around. Our faith in Jesus, as well as the foundational focus of our great country, is all about the hope that can only be experienced through freedom. Hey, it's David Miller, the pastor here at Beneva Christian Church. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to like this video.